It's taken 13 months, several detours, and a few headaches. But in the next couple of weeks, Wick Avenue through Youngstown State will be open once again. And with more about all of the improvements, here's First News anchor Stan Boney. Well, earlier this week, Youngstown State University announced that the Wick Avenue project is just about complete, that it should be done by the end of the month, and this main artery through the Youngstown State campus will be open for use. Joining me is Ron Cole, the spokesperson for Youngstown State. This has been a, a project long and coming, hasn't it? Absolutely. We're really looking forward to the road opening. We're supposed to have, I believe, the city is planning a uh, ribbon cutting ceremony for the 27th of October. and. I know all of us are very happy about that and really looking forward to the road opening and some of the traffic patterns returning to normal. Now, is it what you expected? Oh, I think it's more than what we expect. I mean, when you consider what this roadway looked like before and what it's going to look like now, it's just a tremendous difference. It really adds to the university, doesn't it? The brick and the look and everything that's involved? Absolutely. Some of those uh, enhancements that uh, have been put in uh, towards the end here of the construction, I think is really helped quite a bit. We're doing some uh, some crosswalks. We're going to have the YSU Block Y imprinted in the middle of the road. And so I think it's going to really tell people when they come down this road that not only are you in Youngstown, but you're at Youngstown State University. How big of a problem has it been? Uh, it, I mean, it's, it's significantly changed traffic patterns. This is one of the two major thoroughfares through the campus. So to close it down for a whole year, has, has meant a lot of adjustment, but I'll tell you what, we've received very few complaints. Students have been very flexible in figuring how to get around it, and uh, I think they're going to be very happy uh, to see the result. All right, Ron Cole, thanks very much. Right, sure do appreciate you. it. Again, you heard him. They're explain, expecting a ribbon cutting at this point uh, as of now on October the 27th, so before the end of the month, uh, the Wick Avenue area through Youngstown State University will be open once again. In Youngstown, Stan Boney, WKBN 27 First News.